Hello friends, what's up? Welcome in the world of Mass Biology. In today's learning concept video, we will see Angular and Regular Polygon Part 2. I strongly suggest to you, please must watch the concept video of Angular and Regular Polygon. Link of that concept video is given in the description. Okay, now let's start. We need to find the angle in a regular polygon. Say, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I is a regular nonagon and we need to find angle C, D, G and angle D, A, G. In the previous concept video, we have seen how we move the anti-clockwise direction and how we consider that the middle point should be the middle one. So, C and G is our extreme point and D middleman. For this question, C and G are the extreme points and D middleman. This question is given other polygon of the A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, D and G are the extreme point and here is A middleman. We only move anti clockwise direction from extreme point to extreme point. We C to G in an anti clockwise direction. We D to G in an anti clockwise direction. And one point you should know. This movement may after middle term aapko pass nahi karna chahiye. What do you mean? Main G se C bhi ka sakta hoon for the question number 1. I can move G to C but ye D aapka class karega. So we move kaise karna hai? C to G. One movement, two movement, three movement, four movement, five movement. Yaha five movement hua hai and we know for the one movement 180 by N and 9 hai that is 20. Nothing but 100 degree. The formula is quite simple. That is gap into 180 degree by n. The gap is extreme point to extreme point in anti-clockwise direction means leftward, but upper middle point of the passage. Now check this way. DAG upper D extreme point and G extreme point and A is the middle. Other than D to G jaga, A up the class jaga. Means we jana kya hai? G to D. One moment, two moment, three moment. So three moments when 180 hai and nine nona guns hai, that is 20, so it is 60 degree. So in today's learning concept video, which is nothing but a part two of the previous video, we move karna hai extreme to extreme. And gap find karne me, aapka middle point, jo aapka middle point, angle hai, jahan angle ban raha hai, us path ko disturb nahi karna. Now for better understanding, solve a question. Now we have two questions. One, a, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J is a regular decoder. Find the angle D, E, F. Another question is A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J is a regular decoder. Find the angle D, C, F. How we can find where the gap into 180 by N? D and F are the extreme points and E is the middle. So, we have two ways. Either D to F down or F to D down. In the F to D, E is flat. After D to F down, that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. So, the gap is 8 into 180 divided by 10 this is your answer 18 into 8 144 degree I hope it is clear Aapko movement dena hai extreme to extreme in the anti-clockwise means left hand side mein aapko point class nahi kar now check D and F D is this point F is this point and when you can make a C C is the middle point agar mein D to F move karna to C class karega so I am just moving F to E one movement two movement so gap is what 2 into 180 divided by 10, that is nothing but 36 degree. Both D and F are the extreme points. A may answer 144 RR, 36 RR. Why? Because if we have D and F are the two points, one side other half the angle 36 they are there, but two side 144 they are definitely because these are the concept of cyclic quadrature. Summation is 180 degree. So, if you have this angle, 144 aata hai, so in this direction it should be 36. But following the question, the concept is we move from left to right, extreme point to extreme point. You class not have to clash the middle position. I hope it is clear. If you have any doubt, feel free to opinion. Thank you and happy life.